we pretty much decided that whenever we get a wind forecast, make it 20 degrees more foul, stronger than forecasted. With mixed swell. With mixed swell, and that's generally about what you're going to get. But, we're making good time. One reef in the main, the Genoa is probably at 80%. as well, doing our thing. And here we are, just plodding along. Thankfully it's gotten a little bit better than it was previously. Amelia's dropped our course a little since we were getting high of our course. And the wind is just a little bit to the north. Only 15 miles. So here we are in Governor's Harbor. We just made it in. Dropped our hook. We're in about 12 feet of water with 100 feet of chain out because it is windy. But thankfully, we've got some pretty good protection. Governor's Harbor looks pretty cool. The wind shifted from supposed to be northeast to like east northeast and then went completely east by the end of our day. So on Velocer, the Alban Vegas originally came with 130 gallon tank under the V-berth um, which is great for weekending but not enough for cruising. So we put a collapsible tank, rubber tank, in the compartment just aft of it and then we it maybe fills up to about 30 gallons. We've also got a 20 gallon tank in the starboard cockpit locker and so we can really load up on water when we go out to more out of the way places. You can catch rainwater, but it's not the easiest thing to do especially on a little boat like this because whenever the squall comes through with enough rain to be worth it, it's also blowing snot so tarps fly and that type of thing. So it's good to get water. We use collapsible bring them back out here and we'll use uh, a cap full of bleach for every tank just to make sure that it gets get and stays clean. and it seems like it needs that extra rinse. 